In this video, we will show you how easy it is to verify that your chemical can work with the S6A. What we have here is a blue light A3 paracelsic pump, an S6A chemical flow meter, and a blue white polyethylene skin. We also have a laptop with the Blue Central software on it, and a USB A to C cord. This is everything we'll need. So the first thing we'll do is plug in the cord into the meter. After you do that, your device should appear on the screen. As you can see here, the device has appeared on the Blue Central software. Click the device name to enter the device summary. From here, you will click on the Setup tab on the right sidebar. To run the verification, we will want to make sure that the chemical profile is set to water. Since that is a default, we can leave this one as is and return to the device summary. Now click the Digital Drawdown tab. This screen is where we will run the chemical verification. We will enter a known flow rate value that we can run the pump at. In this case, we will be using 250 milliliters per minute. Do not hit the Start button yet, as we will need to run the pump first. Pump the chemical through the meter at the known flow rate. Here we are setting the pump to 250 milliliters per minute, the same value that we entered into the digital drawdown in Blue Central. Now that the pump is running at the known flow rate, we can hit the start button. If any errors appear, you might want to check your setup and run the test again. If the drawdown is successful, your chemical has been verified and you're all set. Something to keep in mind is that bubbles or particles may affect your results. We recommend using a Y strainer with the flow oriented upwards to avoid these variables. Thanks for watching. If you have further questions, please contact Blue White Tech Support.